Hi, this is Gus with ESCOM and today I'm going to show you a feature of radio detection transmitters that comes in really handy when you are dealing with difficult locates. Today I need to trace this telephone wire and uh, I connected my red alligator clip to the telephone and I connected my uh, black lead to a ground. After checking that I have a good connection to the target line and that I have a good ground, I'm going to turn on the transmitter and verify that I have enough output to complete my locate. So I bump up the power, I'm using 33 kilohertz, wait for the transmitter to settle and it's only putting out 2 milliamps. Sometimes that's all you need to be able to complete your locate but in this case I want more than 2 milliamps. I'm already at maximum output so I need to try something else. Um, I'm going to go into the menus, select the maximum voltage option. Oh, I just passed it. Maximum voltage, I want to enter into that menu option. So I press the center key with the right pointing arrow and I'm going to go from low to high. I'm going to exit out and exit out once more and now you will notice that the voltage goes from 30 all the way up to 90 volts and the, hopefully the milliamps will go from 2 to some higher number. In this case they go up to 6 milliamps at 90 volts and notice the warning sign indicating that there's high voltage between the red and the black alligator clips. This um, uh, voltage maximum is temporary for as long as the transmitter is on. Next time you turn it off and back on it'll default back to 30 volts. So I'm going to show you by turning it on right now and you will see that the maximum voltage at the bottom is going to be 29.9 or 30 and the milliamps will be back at 2. So with this I just uh, showed you a feature that uh, the latest radio detection transmitters have and that will come in handy when you're dealing with a difficult uh, line to locate. For more information on our locators, give us a call. Thank you.